Again, here we go. Camper van this time. Oil's there. Different kind of oil filter this time. Oil filter plug, oil filler plug, sorry. Sump plug. 19mm spanner again, and this weird bolt. No, this smash me phone. And this weird contraption for taking off the bottom of the oil filter. So I will get set up and I'll be right back to you. Here is the oil filter housing. So I've got the pan underneath. Now I'm going to get my tool that I've just paid $11.99 from Halfords for because I didn't have the right size. And that should. I need to get two ends in it. Here we go. That should spin off. And that has got the oil filter inside it. So soon the oil should start coming out. Let's put that up there. Need two ends for this because it's dirty. I don't get covered if I can help it. Right, here we go. Just need to make sure that is under there. That is drooping in. Just let that oil drain out. So it don't go everywhere, hopefully. This tool's quite handy actually, even though it was 11.99, it goes from 63 mil all the way up to 103, so it's handy for lots of different cars, but I have got the other sizes, but just didn't have this size. So. But it's an investment for the future, because now I can do this one again, or anyone else's if they need theirs done. Still draining out. Sump plug's just over there, which is what I'll take out next. But it holds about... I think it was six point something litres, so what I'm probably going to have to do is drain this out. Drain out five litres into this. So I don't think 6.5 plus this will uh, all fit in to my one pound washing bowl from the pound shop. I think we're nearly there with the oil. There. Although looking at that, I think the oil's draining down from the engine as well into that, so might be best just to leave this for a minute instead of pulling that right out and filling this up. It's very really sludgy and black though, so definitely, definitely needed doing. There we go. Yeah. The old oil filter, which I will whip off in a minute and put the new one on. There's the inside of it where the oil filter goes, and the oil comes through and goes through to the engine. Right, let's pause you for a minute and I'll be back. Right, with this filter, you get this, which is a new o ring which stretches over the top of this, and the o ring itself you can't quite see it, it's hidden in there. So I'm going to try and prise that out. I'll just stand you this way. Hopefully you can still see what I'm trying to achieve which is this old o-ring you have to try and hook it out like that go there's the old one let's give this a bit of a clean Get the seats properly now you just put the other one over the top of this you roll it down till you get into that groove then 
you take the filter with these little teeth bits they go inside and it just clicks in like that then 